Okay, this is David B. 69 and this is Out of the Park Baseball 2017. Um, releases next week on Steam. Um, I went a little bit crazy. When I mean a little bit crazy, I went a lot crazy um, for one of the new features of the series. Um, it basically lets you play any team from any era and you could play them against each other um, and it automatically plays them in a series as well you can pretty much go crazy with this um, and I did um, I'll pop it up here in Excel I made a spreadsheet basically that has a bracket of 536 baseball teams all the teams are from 1901 forward from Major League Baseball um, and this is just round one because I needed, basically I needed a bunch of teams and stuff and that could play in the first round because it didn't make the even number of 64 brackets. Um, as you can see, this would be the first round of games. This is the first bracket for, for, the, for games. And this will be the second round, third round and so on and so forth for until each bracket has a champion um and if and basically you can see here there's blanks and stuff that's where like for the example the 1909 giant 1905 giants will be facing off but it's like probably against since i think it was bracket three so they would be playing the winner of the 2014 cardinals against the 1981 expos um since I'm planning on broadcasting this entire series, it's really not necessary to go through all these details. I I did do a screenshot, and I um, if you follow me on Twitter, my Twitter handle is DavidB1969, um, and you'd be able to see I broadcasted. Um, I, I I basically showed those but these photos on on Twitter. Um, so basically what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through and show you how to do one of these. Um, and here I'm going to start off here at the first round uh, with the 2012 Devil Rays against the 81 Phillies. This is very simple gathering. All you have to do is just tell it what era say you want to do world you can do a you could do a world series year or you can just select what year um the phillies were the worst team so i gotta select them first um, let's see 1981 and it'll show you the records yes they were 59 and 48 but that's one of the better records that year um because it was a strike shortened season. Actually, I think uh, halfway through the year, it's, they had a halfway point and stuff, and they it was just really weird. Anyway, so let's see that, and they're facing I think the 2012 Rays. And we're gonna, each one's going to be a seven-game series. Um, a 2-3-2 two, two, using modern era and we're going to allow injuries so we just basically say create expedition and then it goes in the team roster you can look at uh, some of the players on the roster and there's a reserve roster so if there's injuries or such you could technically do do roster moves and stuff and to make sure the teams basically are are good uh, here we go we're gonna play ball we'll leave everything as default um when i get deep in the series i might play some games but for right now i'm just going to simulate okay please won that first game six to one Tampa Bay won the second game, one to nothing. Tampa 
the Rays won the next one three nothing, so it's two to one Rays. Rays won again one nothing. Very close series here. And the Phillies came back and pounded on them ten to three. Um, and you can see game six. Tampa Bay wins it. Um, they won three to the last game three to two. Um, for each game, you can go to the box score. Um, you can check out how what was going on in that game. I mean, it's like you can see Carlton was like on a roll here. So, ooh, okay. During that game, yeah, it said David Price was injured during that game. So, yeah, it says you can open that in an external browser. Not sure what advantage that is. Okay. Oh, I guess it allows you to. Yeah. I guess you can post that somewhere, I guess, and make a. Use an HTML and post it. That's actually kind of cool. Yeah. And it went kapooey. So, anyways, so that's that game. Um, so basically, we just go back and we say Tampa Bay won the series four games to two. So Tampa won the games four games to two. two. So the Devil Rays will move on. Let's see. We'll go back to select teams. And same year, we're going to have the. 81 Yankees. Okay, it seems to be acting slow here. I wonder if you have to go back to the main screen because it's like it was actually really slow. I don't know if that's a bug in the game or what. It's a lot better now. But we'll go back to the 81. The 81 Yankees. And they're going to face off against the 2013. Back to modern. 2013. And it's going to be the Reds. Since Eddie Reds. And again, it's going to be a seven game series. Reds won the first game two to one. Yankees came back nine three. Reggie Jackson and Dave Winfield at homers. Ooh, see now here's one of those situations. Bucky Dent's going to be out pretty much the rest of the series, so I can since he's going to be out. Let's see here. There's Bucky Dent. He's injured. What game you can set up the team roster? Okay, he's on reserve now because he's injured. And then I'll. So we like the next game. Yankees won it. It's a 2 2 series. 
And make me stuck to lead here. Ooh, now we're going to a final game. And the Yankees won the series four games to three. And the series MVP was Dave Winfield. And you can see there, it's like you can see how it's like why he was MVP at four home runs in a series with seven RBIs. So he definitely earned it. So let's move the Yankees here. Game two, three. But you can see how quickly this is and stuff to do. I mean, this is just so easy to run through this stuff. Um, Blues against let's go run back modern modern day here. And the Cardinals won the series. But the interesting part is uh, Andre Dawson of the Expos was actually the MVP. He hit 440 with a home run, three RBIs. Interesting choice. The Cardinals won. Four, two. Okay. see a lot of these games and stuff were based on the strike gear and stuff and everything that's where a lot of these games are coming from because they had the least amount of wins um, and that's where a lot of my basis was um, for having these these first round games Wow. Okay, the Astros won the series four games to two. It was a very interesting series. 
Let's see, how did they do against Detroit? Like Sutton and Nolan Ryan, it's... Nolan oh, Ryan had 19 strikeouts and 13 and two-thirds, while Sutton had, had 18 and 16 innings. Incredibly high strikeout ratio. You can tell Jabba Chamberlain was the, and Joe Nathan were the weaknesses on uh, Detroit's roster. How did the Mets get in here? I think I added them because I needed uh, an even number of teams. Dodgers should kill them. And of course the Mets win. Reggie Smith at the Dodgers is calling for this series, so we have to go to the Dodgers here. There it is. Okay, the Mets won the series rather convincingly, actually. Um, a little shocked. Oh, I played the wrong team. It's supposed to be the 1981. Okay, we're going to have to return. That, unfortunately, that series didn't count. It's supposed to be the 1981 Dodgers. What happens when you go too quick sometimes? Fernando Valenzuela was the main reason that they were a better, a lot better a team. And since the '81 Dodgers was a better team, so I kind of thought it would have, would have happened in the first place. Okay, now we got the 2011 Cardinals. See the ease of switching. Not the nineteen eighty one.
Steve Caddy though. A's. And a 2011 Cardinals advance. Was that four to one? This time we got a. Uh, Nineteen seventy one Cardinals. Somewhere King St. Louis Cardinals against the nineteen eighty one Reds. Oh, that's wrong. The Reds are the away team. Wow, George Foster being out is a huge, huge issue. They don't have anybody good to replace him. I think Cardinals got a little bit lucky on that one that he got injured. Twins. Should be an interesting series. Wow, 
Matt's really scored some runs. But Kyle Lewis is always bad, but and Doc Gooden was always good. Oh wow, the Twins are really. The Mets good. It's pretty much giving them the series right there with that. Um, you know, just a Minato to replace him. Not a bad replacement. And they tied up the series. And the Mets won the game in the series in six series, six games. So the Mets. Accidentally skipped over the other series. Got to go. Let's see. Tiny poor White Sox against the Two thousand eight Brewers. You know the Brewers, the Phillies winded up beating them in the playoffs on the way to the World Series that year. Yeah. Just look at these two teams, I think the Brewers would have an advantage here. Why they played these games. Let's see here. And in a big shocker, the White Sox actually won win, win that series. And it's four games to one. So good for Chicago. Okay, and there's a bunch of my icons. I know you really wanted to see them. And doing historical exhibition. This will be 2001 Giants. Against. 1986 Yankees. Well, Russ Davis is out. And putting Cody Ransom in his replacement.
and the San Francisco Giants win the series four games to one. That was a little bit of a shocker. Next up, we got the 87 Giants against the 2000 Indians. Should be very interesting this series. Seven. I was going to Rob, sorry. I'm doing a broadcast. Oh. Annoying me. Um, one second. Are you doing homework? Yeah, I want to get pictures printed out in color. So. Um, one second. I will. I'm going to continue this broadcast another time. Until then, I'll be out.